If we have 9 to the power of 2 divided by 3 over 2 multiplied by 2, then what is the simplest possible answer for this expression? Which option do you believe is the correct answer to this question? Mm, everyone thinks this question is so easy, but it confuses almost everyone. Let's dive in and break it down a step by step together. In the first step to solve this question, most people go straight to the exponent which is 9 squared. And rewrite this expression as 81 divided by 3 over 2 multiplied by 2. In the next step, they focus on the multiplication between 3 over 2 and 2. Because they believe multiplication has a higher priority than division. As you can see in the image, they simply cancel out the 2's. And this expression simplifies to 81 divided by 3. Which finally gives them the answer 27. And immediately, they conclude that the correct answer to this question is option B. But this answer is absolutely wrong. Now let's go step by step together and I will show you how we should solve this question. As you can see on the screen, in this expression, first we have an exponent, then a division sign and finally a multiplication. To solve this question, we must follow the PEMDAS rule. In this rule, P stands for parenthesis. E stands for exponent, M stands for multiplication, D stands for division, A stands for addition, and S stands for subtraction. It means that we perform all the operations in this expression exactly according to the PEMDAS rule, in order from top to bottom. First, we must start with the exponent, because in this question, the exponent has a higher priority than the other operations. So, instead of this expression, we can write 81 divided by 3 over 2 multiplied by 2. In the next step, we move on to the division and multiplication. However, it's very important to note that multiplication and division have exactly the same level of priority in the PEMDAS row. In this situation, the best approach is to start from the left and move toward the right, performing these two operations in order. So, we'll start with the expression 81 divided by 3 over 2. Okay, whenever we see a division sign between two terms, the best thing to do is to apply the KCF rule. In this rule, K means keep the first number as it is. C means change the division sign to multiplication. And F means flip the second fraction. So, we remove the highlighted part and we write this expression as 81 times 2 over 3 multiplied by 2. Now, we can easily simplify the number 81 with the 3 in the denominator and instead of this expression, we can write 54 multiplied by 2, which finally gives us the answer 108. Therefore, option D is the correct answer to this question.